Hey guys, what's up? It's Presley and welcome back to my channel. Oh my god, I feel like I haven't done my intro in so long. Today, I'm gonna be showing you my perfect summer makeup routine. Before we get started, do not forget to like, subscribe, and toss post notifications so you can notify every time I post a brand new video. And don't forget to go follow me on all my social media platforms. They're all Presley. My name. Okay, let's go. So I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna be real with you guys. Um, it is currently almost 10 o'clock. It is almost 10 o'clock at night. Yeah, I'm gonna be doing my makeup anyway because I am dedicated. Hashtag dedicated YouTuber. So first step of my makeup routine is to put my hair back. Usually I have like the clips that don't put a dent in your hair, but I think they're in one of my bags, one of my like 50 bags. Um, and I'm not gonna go through those right now. I literally look insane. So the actual first step is to moisturize and skin prep. Personally, I believe this is the most important step of your makeup routine. So does Hailey Bieber. So if you don't wanna to listen to me, listen to her. Starting off with moisturizer. This is the Drunk Elephant Polypeptide Cream. I believe that's how you say it. Um, but then I also mix it with this hydration serum. I use these two products in my morning skin care as well, which I can do a whole video on if you want. I usually switch it up right before I do my makeup. Instead of using um, vitamin C serum, I use this. I don't know how to say that. Mar... M-A-R-U-L-A. -A. Whatever that is. And then I just rub it in my face. It's very hydrating. And my skin gets really dry sometimes. Which is weird, as I never had dry skin until I moved to California. Because New Jersey is so humid, and California is so dry. Um, so yeah, now I guess I develop dry skin. So now that my skin is prepped, one more thing I do before I start my makeup is I put on lip balm. I actually do a lip mask instead of lip balm. This is from Morphe 2. It's the Lippy Lullaby. Now let's do actual makeup. Woo! Just a disclaimer. My makeup routine changes pretty much every day. Um, but this is what I'm doing right now in this moment. So I'm going to take a little bit of this Rare Beauty Tinted Moisturizer. This is the shade, is it 16C? I don't know if that's like a shade or if that's just like something on the bottle. Um, and I just kind of put it lightly like all over my skin just to kind of even it out a little bit. Cause sometimes in the summer, my skin gets like darker in some places. My forehead's in the sun more than my chin or something. It happens a lot, it's weird. My face is usually like two different colors. The other day I was laying outside and I got really burnt here and this part of my forehead. So it was like bright red, bright red, and then pale. So not a good look. So we fix that with this very amazing product. And I use tinted moisturizer all the time instead of foundation. I like literally, you will never catch me using foundation because it's so light on your skin. And who wants to wear heavy makeup and like cakey makeup, especially in the summer? Not me. Okay, so now that my moisture, tinted moisturizer is all blended in, I'm just gonna take this concealer and put it on any like red mark spots that I have, like this one here, here, and then just a tiny bit under my eye. I've actually been using the Drunk Elephant eye serum morning and night. And honestly, I feel like my eye bags have been much less noticeable or less dramatic, I guess is a good word. Now I'm just gonna blow it and On popular opinion, your fingers are better than makeup brushes. Maybe that is a popular opinion, I don't know. But it's my opinion though. I don't know if like the concealer like on the outside of your eye and then the inside works, but I see Hailey Bieber doing it, so I do it, of course. I do anything Hailey Bieber does, but like honestly, who doesn't? Okay, next step, I don't do contour usually, uh, just because I don't have a cream contour and I don't like to use powder products when I'm only using like cream product products everywhere else. So I just skip contour or bronzer, whatever you want to call it. Are contour and bronzer like two different products? Are they the same thing? Because I feel like they do the same thing. I don't know. I always use them the same. I'm going to go straight to blush first. So we're going to start with this. This is the um, Benetton. I really like this, but when you use it, you have to put it on 
and blend it in right away or else it will literally stain your face. And I learned this the hard way because I put like a dot on my cheek, a dot on my other cheek, and then a dot on my nose and then blended it in and by the time I got to my nose, it wouldn't blend and I just had a pink dot on my face. But I really like this because it doesn't, honestly, it doesn't look like you put blush on your face. It just looks like my like natural color if I was to get a sunburn, which is like the best color I get on my face. Okay, now I'm gonna do my nose. Okay, and then over top of it, I'm just gonna do like a very, very small dot of this liquid blush from Lonnie London. Like very small, when I say small, like extremely small amount. Look at my fingers. Moving on to eyebrows. And I do the bare minimum for eyebrows. Guys, I don't know why I look so pink in this camera. Don't look like that in real life. Anyways, what I'm gonna do for my eyebrows is brush them up with a spoolie. And we're done. Gorgeous. Now, it's time for eyelashes. And I have been getting so obsessed with my, like doing my eyelashes recently. So I'm so excited to show you guys what I do. I think I've mastered curling my eyelashes. I'm gonna show you how I do it. So I take my eyelid and I pull it up like gently like this. Then I take my curler and I put it on my lashes, but I get to the root, like the absolute like root of my lashes and I curl. Like you should feel it. Not like, don't hurt yourself, but you should like feel it on your root. And it gets like curled, but not like bent. Because sometimes I like, if I curl in the middle of my lashes, they get bent and they don't look long. They just look like crunched. Best mascara out there. I'm actually running out, so I need a new one, but best mascara skinny brushes in my opinion are way better than the thick ones one coat come on mascara hack so then you go from the back of the lashes so you go behind them and then you roll them up like this i swear all the difference all the difference and yeah, it like gets on your eyelids, but you can clean that up after. I love watching people do like mascara tutorials on TikTok. Like that's like a comfort like video is mascara tutorials for some reason. I honestly feel like the most popular one, the most pop popular mascara is Bad Gal Bang and Telescopic. Now I just do like lightly do my bottom lashes. I'm gonna clean up my eyelids. I'll be right back. Eyes are all cleaned up, and we're actually almost done with our makeup routine. We should have like two or three more steps. Um, now I'm gonna use this Their Real Extreme Precision Liner from Benefit. No surprise, I love Benefit. Now, this is a liquid liner. This is a big step for me. I usually use eyeshadow or a pencil. I've been using liquid recently because I found the perfect way to put on eyeliner. So I usually start from like the corner, like I touch the corner like where like the top and the bottom meet. And I just like draw, lay like diagonal up. It's super light. Cause I think I left it out and it dried up. Okay guys, so now that my liner is done, the very last step of my routine is any lip balm. Um, I use my drunk elephant one. I use this one, which is just like a random like watermelon lip balm I have in my drawer, or I use the Mario Badescu one. Those are my go-tos. And that is my whole makeup routine. Okay, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I had so much fun making it, and I'm so glad to be sitting down talking to you guys in front of my camera again. I feel like it's been so long, so I'm so happy to have fun this video for you guys. If you liked it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe, and turn post notifications so you get notified every time I post a brand new video. Make sure to follow me on all my social media platforms, and make sure to click the link in the description box down below to go shop my clothing line. Thank you so much for watching. I was number two. Stay sweet. See you next time. Bye. I love you.